Tomo News presents Dog Survival Stories. Hurricane Harvey couldn't keep this dog down. As Hurricane Harvey swept through the state, a lost dog in Texas showed it takes more than a raging storm to beat it. Before Hurricane Harvey's landfall Friday night, Sinton resident Salvador Segovia left his grandson's German Shepherd mix Otis in his screened in back porch. When Segovia went back to check on Otis later, he was gone. Segovia checked his porch the next day and noticed Otis's bag of dog food was missing. Segovia went looking for the dog and was told by a neighbor they saw Otis strolling around with a bag of dog food in his mouth. Fortunately, Segovia was able to track down the dog's whereabouts and bring him home before his grandson returned. A neighbor who saw Otis thought he was a stray and took a snap of him strolling around with the dog food and uploaded it to Facebook where the image went viral. According to Segovia, Otis is loved by the folks in Sinton, and he's been helpful to Segovia's five-year-old grandson, who often goes to the hospital for seizures and asthma. Police rescue dog trapped in mud. Pennsylvania police officers don't give two cares about getting dirty if it means saving man's best friend. Sheila Shore thought it was strange that her 13-year-old dog Pluto didn't come home Tuesday night. She didn't find the pooch until day three of the search, but when she did, she found Pluto trapped up to his neck in two feet of mud. Look close, he's right there. The dog was fighting to keep his nose above the surface until help arrived. The mud pit Pluto got stuck in Tuesday night was near a creek not far from Shore's home. The dog struggled to survive for the next 60 hours. This was the scene officers were called to Friday morning. Officers prepared a makeshift gurney and didn't hesitate jumping in to help the canine. Both officers were required to remove the dog from the mud pit. The final moments of the rescue were captured on video. The pooch could hardly move as it was transferred to the vet. Shore said Pluto still had some matted hair and walks with a limp, but he's on his way to a full recovery. Good eye spotting him, Miss Shore, and props to Officer Mike Kushner and Sergeant Michael Martin for doing the dirty work. Loyal dog protects injured doggy friend on snowy train track for two days. An injured dog that was stranded on snowy train tracks near Uzohord in Ukraine was watched over by her loyal friend for two days until help arrived. Local resident Denis Mulafiev found the two dogs named Lucy and Panda on December 26th. Panda became cautious when the dogs were approached. Mulafiev said on Facebook that Panda took care of Lucy by curling up next to her. Both of them would press themselves against the tracks when trains passed over them. Mulefayev said Panda took care of Lucy and never abandoned her during their two days on the train tracks. The dogs were taken to an animal protection center where Lucy received medical attention. Thankfully, according to Mulefayev, she only sustained bruises and hematomas. So it's not exactly clear why the dogs stayed on the tracks. The Animal Protection Center found the dog's owners, and the doggies were returned to them. In a recent Facebook update, Malafayev noted that not all people would do what Panda did for Lucy. Hero Dog rescues best friend from raging river rapids. Or does he? In an epic video uploaded on January 17th, a game of fetch between two dogs gets out of hand and looks like it could end badly. Two Labrador Retrievers, a yellow and a black one, were playing fetch with their owner by what appears to be some pretty gnarly river rapids. When the stick got thrown a bit too far, the black lab bounded ahead as the yellow lab hung back. As he tried to gather himself, the black lab slipped, careening down the rocks with the relentless rapids threatening to sweep him away to death. Realizing his buddy was in serious danger, the yellow lab jumped into action grabbing the stick and using every last bit of jaw strength in him to pull his buddy back in. Holding onto that stick for dear life, the yellow lab manages to yank his friend back onto the rocks to safety. What an awesome friend and a hero. Or is he? Watch the video again. How dangerous do you think those raging river rapids really are, given that their owner seems fine to play fetch over there? And is that really rushing water or just a creek with a cool stream? 
And does it look to you like the Yellow Lab is trying to rescue his friend? Or just steal his stick and claim victory? Hmm. After examining the replay, we here at Tomo News reverse our call. Seems that Yellow Lab's just a jerk going after his buddy's stick. Dogs might be man's best friend, but when it comes to each other, good luck. Heartwarming photo saves two dogs' lives. Puppies Kala and Kara were doing hard time at an Atlanta animal shelter and were on their way to death row until a cute picture of them went viral, leading to their rescue. These cute little canines had a nice life, but the time was nigh for them to join the other 1.2 million U.S. shelter dogs that are euthanized each year. However, an Angels Among Us pet rescue attendant had a plan. She took the cutest photo ever of two dogs about to be put to death in the hope that someone out there would come to their rescue. Some pooch-loving superheroes moved by the picture arrived exactly two hours and six minutes later to adopt the photogenic pups, sparing them from their death sentence. If the picture alone didn't save these two, the accompanying caption alone might have done the trick as well. It read, <laughs> She's so brave and tells me it'll be okay no matter what happens. She tells me to be brave too, but I don't know if I can be. Holy crap, now that's touching. One of the pup's new parents works as a vet, so clearly this isn't the first dog this unnamed hero has saved. But now, what on earth do we do with the other 1,999,999 pooches that need a home? Blue-eyed puppy still cute, even with his head stuck in an exhaust pipe.
Puppy trapped down well finally freed after 11 days. The delicate life of a three month old puppy stuck down a well brought all of Turkey together, praying and working tirelessly for his rescue. The deep pit was drilled roughly 11 days ago by local government in Istanbul. Somehow, the puppy slipped his way through the tiny well, measuring less than a foot in width, and tumbled nearly 230 feet down. Locals heard the puppy's cries and sent for a rescue team to get him out. They threw sausages in there to keep him fed and managed to lower a night vision camera down to keep an eye on him. They also dropped chew toys down carrying the scent of the young dog's mother to keep him feeling loved. Watching over him from a screen above ground, day and night, municipal workers and animal activists tried different methods of bringing the pup back up. Students at a local high school even employed a robotic arm they designed in a relentless display of determination to free the small pooch. After 11 days of failed attempts, a state-owned mining company stepped in and dropped down a long, long lasso. They managed to slide it around the dog's neck and slowly, carefully pull him up, up, and up some more until, well, just watch. <laughs> Miraculously, the dog was okay and didn't lose any weight during his time in the hole. Must have been all those sausages. After being checked out by veterinarians, the local fire department decided to adopt him. Maybe so one day, his death-defying experience might come in handy toward helping other animals who find themselves in cramped, dark, sticky situations. Oh, and in case you're wondering, his rescuers decided to name him Kuyu, which in Turkish means well. Isn't this wee guy just the cutest? Meet Cheech. This little guy is a rescue dog at the City of Waller Animal Shelter in Texas. Some volunteers at the shelter initially believed this was Cheech snarling and were scared of him. But they soon found out that that's no snarl. That's an old-fashioned doggy smile. And that same smile has gone viral. Apparently, he can smile on command and is described as super sweet. And the good news is he's up for adoption. You can find out more about that in the link below. Firefighters going above and beyond. A heartwarming video posted on Facebook shows a group of firefighters in California resuscitating a dog after rescuing it from a house fire last Wednesday, no doubt helping restore at least a few cynics' faith in humanity. While responding to a house fire in Bakersfield, firefighters managed to rescue a dog named Jack from the burning home. However, Jack was unresponsive and could only take shallow breaths due to the amount of smoke he inhaled from being trapped in the blazing building. Bakersfield firefighters then tried using a specialized animal mask to pump the poor canine full of oxygen. Their persistence paid off, and after a few moments and a good old-fashioned back rub, the firefighters managed to bring Jack back from the brink of death. Hooray! Jack was later taken to Bakersfield Veterinary Hospital, where doctors treated respiratory tract injuries and burns to his feet. Jack later reunited with his owner and one of the heroes who rescued him. The video, posted on the Bakersfield Fire Department's Facebook page, has been viewed close to a million times and garnered over 13,000 shares worldwide. The cause of the fire is still under investigation, and Jack's family will be staying at a nearby hotel until they can figure out their next move. Dog stays behind to protect baby goats from wildfire. This is Odin, a Pyrenees dog from Wine Country, California. And these are his goats. Wine Country is currently ablaze with wildfires and Odin was all up in it. His owner, Tembo Hendal, said he and his family caught word of an approaching fire and were trying to leave, but Odin wouldn't budge. Hendal said they even cried for Odin and the baby goats, thinking the worst would come to pass. But to their surprise, they found Odin and the goats, and even some deer alive just a few days later, albeit a bit burned. Now, if you're Norse geeks like us, you're probably thinking Odin went all Odin and sent the fiery giant Surtur back to the pit from whence it came. But that's not the case, at least not here. Hendel reckons that Odin managed to ferry the goats to a rocky area near the home. 
Odin, for his troubles, suffered heat damage to his fur, which turned orange, and some burns to his paws. Meanwhile, much of his human's farm was damaged in the fire. The family has set up a You Caring page to help pay for barn repairs, as well as for water and shelter for Odin, his sister Tessa, and the goats. If you're feeling generous, we've included a link in the description. Dog recruits policeman to help save his doggy damsel in distress. In a real-life Lassie story, a dog in Massachusetts helped save another dog from an icy prison. Jock, a Scottish terrier, was hanging out with his lady friend Annabelle when their world was turned upside down. Police have shown up in their home to take the dog's owner to the hospital for an undisclosed medical emergency. Unable to comprehend why their owner was being taken away, the dogs took off into the woods. But the road was slippery and Annabelle wasn't as light or quick on her feet. Tumbling 30 feet down an icy hill, she suddenly found herself at the bottom, trapped. Acting fast, Jock ran out to the nearest road. As the police vehicle approached, the terrier flagged down the officer, signaling for help. Somehow, Jock was able to get through to the policeman and led him back to where Annabelle was imprisoned. Orange, Massachusetts police officer Chris Blaseglia called in the emergency, and firefighter James Hopkins responded. Hopkins utilized a ground ladder and freed Annabelle from her entanglement. The police department shared the courageous dog story on Facebook following the incident, posting, Apparently, any dog in the right circumstance can turn into Lassie. Hmm, did Lassie ever brave the snow to save her best friend? If not, she's got nothing on Jock.